He might be one of the most adored athletes on earth, but Steph hasn't always made the right splash with everyone. Here are five players that hate Steph Curry. One, Jalen Brown. Back in 2017, Steph Curry gave Jalen Brown a valid reason to hold a grudge. Curry was simply doing what he does best, and he hit a three-point bomb right in Jalen's face. Well, that was sore enough for the Celtic, but the chef cooked up a taunt and some choice words for Brown after the shot went in. Jalen was no fan of the disrespect shown by the Splash Brother. I didn't say a word to him. I was just out there playing D, doing my job. He looked at me and started doing whatever. Jalen Brown. It's not hard to hate Curry when he's just that good. But it's even harder when he hits you with a little trash talk after he humiliates you. There's no doubt that this moment motivates Jalen. And when these two stars face off in the finals, you can bet that the Boston baller will be looking for his chance to get the ultimate revenge. 2. LeBron James Why does the King hate Steph Curry? Well, it's likely because the Golden Boy is one of the few players to ever come for LeBron's crown. When looking at James's career stats versus his fellow basketball superstars, one of his worst winning percentages comes against Steph. Curry is essentially kryptonite for King James. The two icons faced off in the finals for four straight years, with LeBron's Cavaliers only winning one championship. It's safe to say that had Steph not chosen basketball as his profession, the chosen one would have plenty more rings. 3. James Harden it was 2015, and the Beard was on a mission to be crowned the NBA's most valuable player. James Harden had an exceptional season, but there was one baller so good that there was just no stopping him. Steph Curry took home the trophy, and Harden wasn't happy. The 10-time All-Star felt like Steph stole his MVP award. I led the league in total points scored, minutes played. Like I said, I'm not taking anything away from Steph, but I felt I deserved the most valuable player. That stays with me. James Harden. The baby-faced assassin became even more hateable the next season, as Curry grabbed the MVP award again. The Beard would eventually win the accolade in 2018, but he's still likely a little annoyed that Steph snatched his prize for two straight seasons. 4. Damian Lillard Much like NBA's all-time leading three-point scorer, Dame can light it up from anywhere on the court. Problem is, Lillard's greatest performances are almost always met with comparisons to Curry. Dame Dollar might be one of the game's great point guards, but the Trailblazers' matchups with Curry are rarely favorable. Damian Lillard is 0 for 10 against Steph in the playoffs. And let's not forget that the Golden Boy dropped his career-high 62 points against the Blazers. For Dame, it's just not all that fun always coming in second place. 5. Michael Jordan during an interview, the legendary MJ raised a few eyebrows when he declared that Steph might be a great player, but he's no Hall of Famer. The controversial take prompted many to claim that Mike was hating on Steph, but Curry himself seemed a lot more relaxed about Jordan's take. I love MJ. That's my guy. He's obviously, he's the GOAT. I'm sure if you asked him that question now, like straight up, does he think I'm getting in there? He probably would have a different answer. Steph Curry. Maybe Mike was just mad about Steph and the Warriors breaking the regular season win record that Jordan had set with the Bulls. Even so, thanks to the Dubs losing in the finals that season, we're sure his royal airness will always be quick to point out that it don't mean a thing without the ring. You don't make it to the top without making a few enemies, and the chef has been at the top long enough to have a whole team of haters praying for his downfall.